I was crushing on 28 grams of crack cocaine. But then I fell in love with a 28 year old. Both of them are 28. My love, baby, 28. I'll be out just selling. Hey, 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 hey. She said, Hi, YouTube. Hi, <laughs> Give me some. Boom. Bye, Say bye. hi. Say hi. <laughs> we're about to go see Cars 3 at the theaters. It's gonna be pretty sweet. Been wanting to see it for a while. And we're taking my little sissies. Can you say hi, B? No? Hi. Z, what are you doing? She's just sitting here on the tree. What are you doing, Z? You running around like a maniac? <laughs> what are you doing? You ready to go see Cars? <laughs> You guys are funny. Are you excited to go see Cars, Z? We're gonna leave soon. Oh, watch out for your sister. You okay, B? <laughs> They're wild. All right, we're on our way to the theater oh, now. You excited, guys? Can you get yeah. it? Z, are you excited to see Cars 3? Can you get it? Can you get it? Can you get it? <laughs> So I guess we're going to a movie theater that has reclining movie theater seats. It's, it's pretty awesome. awesome. I'll try to sneak the camera in and show you guys what they look like. They're pretty cool. I'm pretty sure you don't but have to sneak it in. I'll just put it in my pocket because, well, it's like a federal crime. It if is? you record the whole movie. Well, I mean, yeah, it's in theaters. Hello. I'm not going to, but I'm just saying I want to show them what the seats look like. Are you excited to see Cars 3? Mm-hmm. I know. So am I. I think she might fall asleep during the movie. She looks pretty tired. ZZ, are you tired? She hasn't had a nap at all today. Oh boy. Well, I don't want you to fall asleep during Cars 3. You haven't even seen the second one yet. I mean, those We watched the first fun. one the other day and she fell asleep like halfway through. dirty these shoes we got. Remember when I first got these shoes, how like much I babied them? Well, when I went to camp, things changed. Went to bonfires and yeah. Now they're just dirty. Just a dirt mess. But it's alright. Probably gonna buy another pair soon. Ready, Z? <laughs> Z, you're just not feeling it, are you? <laughs> All right, so we're here now, and yeah, my sister's asleep, but we're gonna go in soon. Her feet are so. What? <laughs> Trying to find theater three. Right here. Hey. Ready, Z? Movie theater. Let's go. I don't want to see you right here. I don't want to see you. Energy Smart BGE customers are getting comprehensive home performance with Energy Star audits to improve their home's comfort now, these and reduce energy costs. And they're seeing even more with our rebates. How does it work? Two hundred fifty. Push this one and it comes up. dollars on energy saving improvements. Learn more at bgesmartenergy.com/movie. It's a big way. Back. Our leaders are saving energy and money awesome. with a big. In life, we have to conquer odds. Very nice. In life, we have to. Z, do you want to recline your chair? But you gotta keep trying. Look, you're reclining your chair. Look at that, Z. You don't like that? Very These seats look futuristic. See, don't you want to recline your seat? <laughs> University of no? Maryland faculty look. physicians, immediate care in Columbia is now open. <laughs> With x-ray services, you don't like that? Here, push. for testing, there you go. and a pharmacy. Immediate she doesn't care like it being her client, does she? Right away. We treat bone breaks, rashes, viruses, fever, and much more. Ooh, 
I'm just chilling now, waiting for the movie to start. You'll love getting your tickets fast and flying past the box office. Good movie. You'll love earning rewards for concessions, tickets, and more with the Regal Crown Club. And you'll love special offer coupons to make your movie experience more fun. Download the Regal Cinemas app for free. See, is this your first or movie? You in the RV that's right for you. Yeah, I'm in camping. Yeah, you went camping there? Are you excited? <laughs> I think she's excited. <laughs> <laughs> That's fun. Unlocked fun. the ancient secrets. Whoever smelt it, dealt it. All right, what's up, guys? So we're back from the movie. Um, it was a really good movie. It ended a lot differently than I expected it to, but it was really good. But yeah, so now I'm just kind of chilling. Um, I don't know what I'm gonna do. I think I'm gonna do a Q and A here in a couple minutes. So yeah, for now I'm just gonna go chill with the fam and maybe eat a little bit of food. Call her good. Hey V, what's my name? That's my name, yeah. Z, what's my last name? V, what's my name? Kaden. Yep, that's my name, Kaden. And you're Beatrice. Me. <laughs> Editing this video you're watching right now. I'm editing it right now All right, what's up guys? So I'm actually about to eat dinner and then after that I'm gonna go ahead and do the Q&A So yeah, let me go eat real quick first Refreshing Gonna watch a little trailer park boys while I eat Let's do the Q&A. Finally, after I've been putting it to the side for like three weeks now. Q&A. Let's go. All right, for the Q&A though, I'm gonna have some music playing in the background just cause it'd be awkward if I did it silent without everybody sleeping in my house. So yeah, definitely gonna play some music. All right, it is getting real. I took my hat off and I took my glasses off. And I think I'm gonna put my freaking sick sunglasses on. Yeah, you know what? I'm gonna do that right now. That's right, I'm gonna do the Q&A with sunglasses on. So yeah, let's get into it. No more, no more, uh, what's the word? Oh, without further ado, there we go. First question, let me get to the questions real quick. First question asked by Jacob Theme. Describe what BMX means to you and how did I get into riding? Honestly, BMX means fun to me. That's all it is, is just having fun with the homies and learning new tricks and just chilling, you know, being me do my own thing and sometimes it helps me get over if I'm depressed or something. Um, how did I get into riding? I got this bike for, I got like a Haro Complete for Christmas and I never like rode it, rode it at a park. And then I was with my friend Devin, or he was at the park and I saw him there. I was with like a scooter or something, or a skateboard. And he was like, yo, you have a bike, don't you? I was like, yeah. He was like, why don't you go get it and come try it out here? I was like, all right, and it just took off from there. Next question is from Kat. What is your most embarrassing moment? Most embarrassing moment when I was like six or seven and I lived in Colorado and I was standing in the middle of the room with all my family around me. And my grandma comes up and pants me behind me but I didn't have any underwear on so just my whole junk and everything was hanging out. And yeah, it was pretty embarrassing. Let's see here for the q and my boy Andrew from Woodward asked, what's my favorite part of Woodward? Um, that would be Mundo's, the coffee shop, and meeting new people, hanging out and riding the facilities. Troy Hoffman, how's the pink helmet going? You tell me. It's going pretty great. <laughs> just kidding, it's good. I just haven't had the chance to ride in it much lately because of my stupid ankle. Waylon, what made you start BMX? Um, my friend Evan, just watching Dude Tour on TV. Jacob Andrews, my favorite drink, Cotton Candy Fago or iced coffee. My homie Paul asked me who's my favorite pro. And since I'm good friends with him, Colton Walker, and because he's an X Games gold medalist, I mean, come on now. Either Colton Walker, Kyle Baldock too. There's a picture actually behind the camera when I met him in Ocean City at Dude Tour. The last one they actually had. Make sure my hair is on fleek. Anyways, 
Zach Conway asked, will I ever do a 360 double whip again? If you don't know, that's a trick that I hurt my ankle on really bad. Um, I think I will, just not anytime soon at all. Kiara, if you guys remember Alec, it's his girlfriend, asked me, are backflips hard? Oh, I'm curious, I tried today and landed on my head. They're not hard, you just have to jump up really high, tuck in and commit. But they are scary, I will admit, and Alec can answer that if you don't believe me. What's your dream build and favorite rider? Asked by my homie Chris Comperta. My dream build is an all black total BMX setup with a bunch of titanium parts on it and with like maybe red or no with the oil slick colorway I mean and then my favorite rider Colton Walker Kyle Baldock or Tyler Fernangle too he kills it <laughs> Javon Archer asked me why did I shave my mustache because I look better because I look better without any facial hair in my opinion and a lot of people told me to shave it anyways hold on I'm just looking at the sensor make sure I look good my hair's a little wild but Time out. I'm gonna change the song. All right, the next question is by Kish Kebab. Justin Kish, my homie from Woodward, who was my favorite staff member at Woodward. I can't answer that because I have too many favorite staff members there. So, sorry. Um, next question. <laughs> Where does my crush live if I have one? Um, that's TBD. I might or might not have a crush and she may or may not live in North Dakota. Um, Ben, how to's, like, you want me to do how to's? I can do that on my channel sometime. <laughs> Stell Fallen asks, why is he so damn huge? Because you're dedicated to what you do, and you keep grinding at the gym, keep grinding, it's a good thing. I'm jealous. Another question by Alex's girlfriend is, do I like horses? Of course I like horses. What kind of person would I be if I didn't like horses? My cousin has them and I love them. Let me get to the other questions now, one sec. Jack Mold asked me if, by the way, Jack Mold is a fellow BMX YouTuber. If you are not subscribed to him, go subscribe to him. I think it's Jack Mold BMX. Um, he asked, when will I do a 360 whip bar bar? <laughs> I have to do a through whip bar first. Next question is from J.R. Hobbs, my homie. What is my favorite clothing brand? From Lynn, your clothing brand because stuff's fresh. Or anything from Rue 21 or H&M. Their clothes are really sick, but BMX wise, it's yours. My homie Waylon, what made you start BMX? I already answered that one. My mom asked, are you single? Yes. Where, where will you go to college next fall? Probably North Dakota. Um, is your mom really nice? As nice as she appears on all of your videos? Yes, I love you mom. Are you going to do laundry? <laughs> I remember when she asked us, as I was at camp and I told her I haven't done my laundry yet. I got it done, and Katie helped me out. Katie's my stepmom, by the way. Who were your inspirations when you started BMX? That's a good question. Um, my friend Devin, just because he got me into it, and then Brett Banasewicz and Dennis Anderson. I watched all three of those guys kill it, and it was sick. Um, I think there's a couple more here, give me a sec. Who is your biggest in inspiration in BMX right now at the moment is myself, honestly. I don't wanna sound cocky, but like, I'm when I see myself learn a new trick, it inspires me to keep learning new tricks. And also, if I had to pick a pro, I guess, um, and I'm gonna say Dylan Santa and Alex Librock, my Woodward homies. Miss you guys, I love you guys, and thank you for helping me and keep killing it. Um, Nick Joy BMX underscore 15 on Insta DM me and said, why do you ride BMX? I ride BMX because it's fun and, it's, and it can be an escape from reality sometimes. Where do you plan on going to college? Asked by Kyle Konarska. Um, well, basically it's either Devil's Lake, which is my hometown, or here in Maryland. What was the hardest trick to learn in BMX? That's a good question. Probably a decade or... A decade or double whips. Double whips are pretty hard. What's the hardest trick you have ever tried, even if you couldn't do it? hardest trick I've ever tried was probably 360 tuck no handers or um, backflip 360s, those are pretty hard. Troy Hoffman, who is my favorite person to ride with? Um, honestly, I don't have a favorite person. Anybody who's down to ride and learn new tricks is my favorite person to ride with. Whether they ride scooters, skateboards, bikes, inline, whatever, I don't, I don't judge. How long have you been riding? I don't know who asked me that, but four years. 
or coming up on four years in September. Paul asked me, am I your best friend? <laughs> One of my best friends. And if you could learn any trick right now, what would it be? Honestly, this might sound stupid, but knack-knacks, like really steezy knack-knacks, or tuck no hand or airs, like boost them on a quarter and just let those suckers fly. Chor Supersinski, would you rather live in Maryland or North Dakota? Maryland for the opportunities, but I have a lot of family and friends in North Dakota, so it'd be hard to leave behind, although I am in Maryland right now. Um, if you could go anywhere in the world for a week, where would it be and why? Australia, because I've always wanted to go there. They have some of the best skate parks, and just the whole scenery is amazing, and the beaches are sick, and I want to get a thumbnail in front of the Opera House, or just a picture in general. I think there's one more question. The last question is, why do I do YouTube? And the reason I do YouTube is because it's not to make money or anything, it's because I actually love making videos. It's sick, it's just the whole idea of being able to create something so simple and make it into a movie, like whether it be a day of my life like today, or just riding and learning new tricks with all the homies, or you know, it doesn't even have to be BMX, just anything. I just love it, and I love like looking back at it and reflecting on it, it's sick, so. All right, that's gonna conclude the Q&A and this video. Thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure to drop a like, leave a comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Let's hit you guys with the new outro I just made.